aggregate supply is the total supply of final outputs in an economy at a given time. In the short run, the aggregate supply curve will slope upward because the prices of labor and other inputs to production are constant and supply responds to changes in price levels. In the long run, however, supply responds to changes in prices of the inputs, such as labor, raw materials, and infrastructure, which means aggregate supply is affected by production costs, including the wages, taxes, subsidies, and the price of raw materials. How the aggregate supply curve is different in the short run and in the long run is a crucial component of understanding economic shifts in the short run. Short run aggregate supply is the major factor determining short run economic behavior and is highly influenced by prices. The short run supply curve slopes upward because higher prices lead to greater production because of three main theories sticky wage theory, sticky price theory, and misconceptions about relative prices. A sticky wage is a wage that does not change quickly in response to changes in the labor market and explains the upward slope by suggesting that wages only change gradually as economic conditions shift. Basically, wages stick to their current level and shift slowly. Sticky wages thus intensify the pressure put on production caused by price fluctuations. If prices are lower than expected, companies are driven to produce less, while the opposite is true when prices exceed the expected level. A sticky price, on the other hand, is a price that does not change quickly in response to market shifts and is caused in large part by menu costs, which is a cost incurred when a business changes its prices. Companies may set prices at one point only for an economic downturn to strike soon afterward. While some companies might reduce prices immediately, others might be slow to do so out of fear of incurring large menu costs. The third theory states that misconceptions exist when producers mistake price changes for relative price changes and ultimately attribute the upward slope to human errors in decision making. Producers mistake a change in the price of their own products for a change in the relative price of goods in the market. Producers respond to these misconceptions of relative price changes by increasing or decreasing production. Technology, factor availability, and factor prices are held constant along the short-run aggregate supply curve. If any of these change, the short-run aggregate supply curve will shift. If input prices rise, firms will find the profitability of their current production reduced. For any given level of output to be produced, an increase in the price level will be required to achieve the same level of profitability. If price levels do not increase, firms will react by decreasing production. Graphically, this is represented by a leftward shift in the short-run aggregate supply curve. The short-run aggregate supply curve will also shift because of a change in inputs. An increase in the quantity of labor, capital, or natural resources available will shift the aggregate supply curve to the right. A decrease in labor, capital, or natural resources will shift the aggregate supply curve to the left. An improvement in technology results in increased productivity. With increased labor productivity, the unit cost of production fall as long as wages don't rise sufficiently to offset the increased productivity. With no increase in factor prices, firms are willing to produce more goods and services at the same price levels.